the horn. Welcome back everyone, it is uh, two days before it's supposed to have a super cold front hit Illinois here. So I'm going to fish today and tomorrow, make videos on both of them. I'm at a pond next to my house where I caught about a dozen fish last time so hopefully it should be pretty good again. I'm going to be using a jig, a shaky head, and a square bill so let's see if we can catch them. Didn't catch anything at the first spot so I'm going to go ahead and move. Fish number one. At the second spot. Not a terrible one, probably about a pound and a half. Real long and skinny. Got the red teeth. Just on a football jig. There he goes. There's a fish. He hit it. He came back. There he was. That's why I couldn't hook him the first time. That is a very small fish. He is the size of the shaky head worm. Fish number two though. Hooks that felt good on the new rod. Oh, he's on it again. There we go. That fish hit two casts before. And then I, oh, there he goes. I had to really let him eat it. He was pretty small. But fish number three on the shaky hood. You can usually get a fish right here in this corner pretty quick. Hold that one. That's that's a nice fish. Probably pound and three quarter, pound and a half. First fish on the green pumpkin finesse jig I put on. Super nice one. Gotta toss him over the leaves. It's another nice fish, especially for here. That is jig fish number two, and just the same size as the first one. They absolutely are hammering the finesse jig. Super nice one. He swam back on the bank. Okay. okay. Another one, right here. A little bit smaller, but same spot. Absolutely slammed the jig. They are really, really, really liking the finesse jig. <laughs> That's the base one so far. Same spot as the last one. Back to back cast. That's a two pounder, probably. Eh, he probably pounded three quarters. Super nice fish. I'm glad I changed to the green pumpkin finesse jig from a black and blue jig because they obviously are wanting it. I had no idea that fish was on. It was swimming straight at me. Same spot as all the last ones. This one was just on the shaky head. Switched up lures and they are still eating at the same exact spot as the last like four fish. It's insane. There's a fish on the crankbait. Feels like a pretty good one. 
Maybe not. Cannot tell. No, he's a little. He's not super small, but he's not huge. First crankbait fish of the day. Probably about a pound. Gonna go ahead and try the front pond for a little bit. First front pond fish, little guy on the shaky head. Another little guy. Same spot as the last one. Another little one at the front pond. Right on my feet. Another little guy. The fish was running with it. Same spot as the last one, less than a minute later. He's hooked on the outside of the mouth. Saying three casts in a row. Oh, okay. Four casts in a row. This is ridiculous. Same size. Another fish, same, 10 feet down the bank. Also on the shaky head. And another one. These fish are all super tiny, so I think I'm gonna head back to the back pond again. So, see you guys back there. There we go. That's right, I came back back to the, this pond from the front one because this fish is bigger than every single one I caught in the front even though it's still little. Crankbait fish. Oh, that fish just slammed it. That would have been back-to-back -back cast. Oh, he came back for it. That's a lot nicer of a fish than every single one we caught in the front. <laughs>